Hey everybody, this is Anna reporting. Let's check how much we are damaged by the sanctions from Europe and North America. <laughs> this is so damaging. We don't have any products left. Somebody help us. Send humanitarian aid, please. We we cannot leave over here. Oh my god. We are just starving. We're starving in here, okay? It's it's a it's a, um like um mm, what kind of uh, bag of sanctions is it? I don't know. But it looks brutal. It looks brutal over here. Somebody help us. We, uh, we, um, we are suffering, yo. So, uh, I just hope everybody can see how bad we are and how horrible it feels to have all these sanctions on us. And, uh, yeah, you should kind of uh, pity us Russians because uh, without your without your European and American products, especially Canadian, you know, Canadian uh, are the best, uh, you know, shale oil, shale oil, slab oil. When you sort of. Uh, get uh, the gas from the bu bubble that's uh, deep under the ground that's um uh dinosaur farted long time ago now we have to survive somehow with uh empty shells and all of that you know it's tough it's tough yeah Some some way somehow we need to get back to the relation with this wonderful garden that is Europe and European Union and we uh, horrible barbarians uh, have to accommodate and grow internally into all of this uh, achievement of the Western world, including, including the acceptance of the LGBTQ and uh, all the rest of it, kind of uh, should sound promising to everybody that once we are into all kinds of stuff like that and our children are shown penises of adult men in the kindergartens will be fine and will be accepted back again into this wonderful Western European family and their wonderful garden where we where we um where we Russians once were allowed in to serve and feast on crumbs thrown to us from the master's table, you know. We want this huge, amazing thing back. Yes, we, we, we suffer badly under sanctions. Help us.